So, good afternoon. You're joining me today. Uh, I just wanted to put a few miles on the bike because uh, it's in for a service in a couple of days. And um, I haven't got quite enough mileage on it for the first service of 600 mile. And uh, I thought I'd come up here and share this with you. This is the beautiful Y Valley. The stretch of road that we're on today is only, it's from Monmouth down to kind of Chepstow, Tinton Abbey area. So um, I'm just going to film the, this and have a bit of a chat and see how we all are. It's very nice. Oh, there's a, like a wooden shack over there. Looks very nice. Oh. It brings out the wildness in you, doesn't it? You know? Anyway, I got this camera, uh, the DJI camera on ultra wide now. So I don't know if that's going to be a good thing or a bad, but I wanted to get the mirrors in. So if I can hopefully get both mirrors in, that would be good. So, uh, yet again, I'm testing the bike, the camera, you know. Uh, so far, I've done, let me have a look here, I've done 505 miles now from, from new. I need 600, so the plan is now I'm just going to go down to Chepstow and then bomb it home along the motorway. So it's gonna it's gonna put me up around about I don't know 560 I would think 565 by the time I get home. Then I gotta go to Cardiff for the service. So that's another 20 miles. So it's gonna be almost on the 600. God, dear, oh dear. What have we got here? Let's see if we can um, get past kind of understand you know these people they just want to enjoy the scenery and have a little bimble about as do I oh look at this oh lovely open road and uh, oh some lovely houses nestled into the valley there. I've only been on this road about, um, I don't know, four or five times really in, in my biking career. It's not, uh, not somewhere I, uh, I come that often, but it is very nice. We're running alongside the River Wye here. Oh, I think it's the River Wye. got to be the river why what else could it be so uh, I'm still loving the bike the only sad thing is I haven't been able to get out on it that much I had it on the first of March the weather has been pretty bleak wet windy with a few nice days oh look at this bridge here it's nice isn't it and uh <coughs> excuse me oh, a bit of gravel on the floor on the road oh you bugger look at this road here Let's have a stand up. Look at the bridge, I should say. <laughs> I bet that was an old toll house, sir. Uh, collecting money. Isn't it awesome, isn't it? I've forgotten what I was saying now. Oh, uh, yeah, and um, the other excuse I've got is uh, I, I've been on the sick from work for a few days, a week and a half or so, because uh, 
don't laugh. I fell out of the truck. I was climbing up into the cab and uh, went to grab the grab the steering wheel and yeah, massive fail. Fell back out, landed on my feet, jolted my back, and then immediately fell back onto my back. Yeah, that was uncomfortable. Look at these houses up here. so nice to live in such a beautiful area, isn't it? Thank you, sir. There is um, up on the right hand side somewhere along here. There's a, a place called the Eagle's Nest. Not the one in Germany who was gifted to uh, Adolf Hitler. But, uh, but one here that I believe you have to walk to it. So I won't be going there today. Um, but it gives a good view of the river and the, the, the valley and everything, you know. It's a beautiful area. Once again, I'm um, spoiled by traffic a little bit. I was doing my 60 mile an hour, according to that, on the cruise control. Um, but I couldn't help noticing on the on a tom tom. It was actually reading 56 miles an hour. And right here now I got 40, 39, 40 miles an hour. 38 now. And the tom tom's reading 35, 36. It's quite a difference, isn't it? So I bought um, I bought a Speedo Angels screen cover thing protector. That's the word protector. I fitted that on. Just about got it in place. Um, to be honest, it has made the uh, it's made it a little bit more sort of dull, a little bit more matte. It doesn't pop quite as much. You know, it's okay. But it's almost as if there's a film on top. Perhaps there is. Protective cover, I don't know. No, I don't think so. I took the other one off, obviously, for the sticky side. Gosh. Anyway, we'll just to admire the scenery. Ah, pigeon. Suicidal pigeon. Here we are, Tintin already. Right, sir. I have noticed a um, hell of a lot of bikers now do not bother to nod, acknowledge in any way whatsoever. What's this? 20 miles an hour zone again, look. Bloody ridiculous. Oh, I can see Tintin Abbey over there. Anyway, I just wanted to... Uh, 
actually say why I haven't been around much and um, indeed in the future for the for the remainder of this year I, I I'll be putting up a few videos but it won't be that many because um, we're having an extension built on the house I've had to kind of do away with my office at the moment where the computer is going to be is all set up so let's go and have a look in here is it just have a quick look at Tintin Abbey I know we've been here before oh god almost missed a turning look at that eh That is quite nice. I think we'll uh I think we'll just go and have a quick look. There's a tea room there. anyway I might catch you a bit later we'll see for now adios managed to bag myself a cup of coffee very nice <laughs> Well, I must say that <coughs> that was very nice. I had a little chocolate cake out of there, which I shouldn't have. And um, an Americano, very nice. What a place this must have been back in the day. As uh, Henry VIII is responsible for... Um, For knocking that down or, or making it a ruin anyway ah oh, gorgeous so that was Tintin Abbey um, a little bit between Monmouth and uh, Chepstow nearer to Chepstow to be honest but, uh, but yeah, all very well. God, I can smell burning. I hope it's not me. I'm not on fire, am I? Oh, my God. No. Ah, something is burning. So, that was very nice. Yeah, nice little stop. You know, really, I should be in like fourth gear for that. But this thing handles it so well in sixth gear, top gear. Oh, what a view. Yeah, I'm not much good at giving reviews on bikes or anything, you know. No doubt, this is not the perfect bike. Not even for me. But, um... But I'm very happy with it. Yeah, it's very nice. Okay, change down. Down to third. Oh. Listen to the quick shifter. Oh, just... For an old man, an old man like myself, this is, you know, this is all I want, this is great, fantastic. 
I'm gushing, aren't I? So, as I say, you know, the whole idea of coming out today, <clears throat> well, just to enjoy a bit of a ride, a bit of a, it's always nice to get out. And uh, what have I done here? Believe it or not, God, I'm, I've done almost a hundred miles. I've come up from Bridge End um, and did all the back roads really up to Brecon, Abergavenny, across to Monmouth. I think it's about 45, 50 mile home from here, so. You know, that's going to be, it's going to be pretty close to 600 by the time I take it into Bevan's to get it serviced. I'm not sure which way to go back yet. We might, uh, might just hop on the motorway, which is going to be a bit boring, but uh, it, it's the most direct route. Or again, I might do some of the back roads. This is Chepstow Race Ground here, if you can see on there, on the left. <coughs> Excuse me. And in the distance was the old Severn Bridge. And that's a bird. Oh, you know me, I can't resist it. Chepstow race ground for the horses. sun visor down yeah you know, why is it yeah you know, when I close the old visors up and everything I always get a bit of an itch you know it's either a itchy nose or an itchy cheek in this case god yeah Take my hat off to you, sir. I think we'll uh, go up here. I must say, it, it, it's nice, isn't it, to get out on the bike, you have a, an hour and a half riding or whatever. Oh, nice. And then you can stop, you know, you find yourself in a little place like Tintin there, and they got a tea room. Have a cup of coffee and a, and a cake, or a cup of tea and a cake. Very nice. Right. Oh, look, before I go, again, I just want to say again that I, I do apologise. Please bear with me. But probably for the next six months, there's not going to be that many videos. There will be a few. I'm going to Belgium uh, in May with me mate Tim. So... There'll be a few, but not that many, you know, I mean, I've got to move the bike out to my mate's house for a, a few weeks, because the builders need uh, access to the garage, and 
you know, everything. It's a bit of a project. We're having all internal works done as well. So, um, uh, just bear with me and uh, hopefully things will get back to normal after the, after the build is done. Right. A48. Let's go down the A48, eh? Save the motorway a bit. Doc Martin in front. Just to my left there is the old Severn Bridge and the Bristol Channel. Anyway. Right, we will uh, we'll catch you again next time. Thanks everybody and thank you for bearing with me. Cheers. Bye-bye.